Right, hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Everything on Keyboard. I'm actually kind of looking forward to getting this outfit on to see what it actually looks like. I haven't seen it or actually used it at all before. So these are going to be really, really straightforward and really, really simple. So I won't be doing much today. Um, reach this off-road speed of 65 kilometers an hour. Pretty straightforward. Let's just go into... Mmm, canyons, I'm feeling. I feel like that might be a better way of doing it. It's still possible-ish, uh, and I could have just maybe thrown this in the bin. It's probably easier to do it on the highlands, but I feel like we go there every single time, so it might be a bit more fun doing it this way. Um, I don't know how I'm really going to get the off-road speed, considering the the bits that are off-road are just bloody like... Uh, I wouldn't say cliff faces, but they're sure as hell some big hills, so you can't really ride down anything off-road that quickly. I suppose I just have to wait and see if I can get a uh, off-road section. This is 65? Yeah, okay. We managed to do it anyway, so ignore what I was talking about. I'm so glad you're alive, mate. I have no idea what you decided to do there. But as long as you're alive, it all, it's all that matters to me, mate, honestly. Thank you very much for not dying there. Right, we definitely got the uh, 500 rep per track. That was easy. And we didn't bail, so that's another W. Right, I'll be taking uh, speed wobbles. Um, this one, I guess. Oh, less curves. And, well, less curves and no stunts, but it's probably still doable. Oh, two people on my roof. Not my roof, the roof across from me. Okay, so it's just off-road. You don't even need to ride off-road. It just will randomly give it to you. Okay, that's fine. Thank you very much, game. It makes it so much easier for me because I didn't realise that you were going to be doing it like that. But apparently everywhere counts as off-road on here. And so that works for me. I don't have to do anything about it then. Right, 65. It's riding just going at 65 is off-road here. It's everywhere class as off-road on this bit. I'm even on the path and it counts it. That was a bit too close for comfort. I don't. I didn't check the speed, so I, I guess I didn't hit it. It's a way easier than I thought it was going to be. There we go. That's that one done. Um, look for something similar and do it again. I guess. Right. Th 360 twice. That's not too difficult. Is there any stunts? That is the real question. I mean, it doesn't really matter too much because I don't need the extra life. It's just always nice to do the challenge when it's nice and easy. Why not? Who? Who? It's no harm getting an extra life. You never know when you might need it. I might accidentally just crash into something without realising. Anything at all? Some sort of downhill, please, would be nice. Uh, not just riding up or being really flat. Uh, how am I meant to hit 65 kilometres an hour here if you're not going to go downhill? Thank you very much. Right, here we go. Time for the speed. Okay, that's not what I thought was going to happen. Um, ooh! um, why not? Yeah, sure, that will work. Okay. Right, yeah, um, the game uh, wants to keep me alive for some reason, I've got no idea what happened there, but yeah, it still counted, still did it, cool, and I somehow also didn't bail off of slamming my front wheel into that berm, I thought I was done when I saw that, the flip I was like, okay, alright, we're fine, and then when I saw, oh, that front wheel is going to eat that berm, I'm somehow still alive and going, why is the finish, like, in here, what, okay, that's the first time I've seen it go back on itself to do that, Right, um, I'll take that because I don't really want no path, but I guess we just keep going. Uh, why not? Let's do a little helmet cam. Right, finish without braking is definitely possible. We've got to go off path at some point. Hopefully not like that because um, we have to do it one more time, luckily. Uh, and then we've got to uh, do two more nodes, which will be this one. Oh, see, anywhere just counts as off-road for that one. So if you've ever got that task, just ride around in the desert and it will just randomly tick off any time that you go that speed. Everything... Ouch. Okay. Everything counts as off-road here for some reason. That's the one thing I don't like. I feel like you would adjust yourself if you came off of that. Like a berm. But no. Okay, never mind. I guess we're just going to slam into the floor sideways as always. Right up here we go. This does feel like a bit of a roller coaster to be fair. Okay. Now I'm definitely not on a roller coaster anymore because it's not nice and smooth. Ooh. Okay. Yep. Oh, yep. Yep. No, no, no. Sure. Why not? Oh, this is arboreal, but we can ride on a bloody cactus, mate. I don't even know how that's happened. I can't see that, actually. I'm going to save that. Just call it cactus. Yep, all that. Why not? I just completely fat-fingered the wrong key, but sure. Um, 
I kind of want to see if he did a tire tap on it. Well, it would be the thumbnail if he did. If not, then uh, I guess I, oh, whatever the thumbnail is, is whatever the thumbnail is. It sometimes is quite fun when the game gets a bit chaotic when you're riding. You're like, oh, I've got to really just combat this and stay alive. That makes it a bit more fun. I don't know how many people have to deal with that and can make it out alive or they just fail. But for me, a lot of the time, it's just like, oh, quickly spam slide from side to side and you'll more or less make it out a half of the time. And I do, and it feels very, it puts me on edge. Like every time you see me tense up any time I think something's going to go wrong. But it, it's still quite fun. It still puts me on edge if I'm going to bail. Even though it really doesn't matter if I bail or not. It, it, it genuinely puts me on edge when it happens. Why did it happen there? I thought I'd have been fine. Well, I didn't let go of acceleration, so I will take that one life that I lost back. Thank you very much. Um... I guess we just go and do this one. Why not? Why not? Let's have a little ride. High speed action downhill. Don't need to do it. But it was in the way. So why, let, why not? Let's do this once a node. It would be cool if they carried over to when you did the one next time. It's a lot easier to ride this in first person because you can see what's coming up. Right over this one. Got a pump just so I can stay a bit more stuck for the floor even though that didn't really work. Don't want to fall down that big chasm there. Otherwise I get stuck at the bottom. Hey, here's a big drop again. These are, this is like, this is what Kinetic is about, this this sort of area. Because these are really fast. Like, in, like, almost in the black speed zone. Like, that's a very quick. And we're done. Yeah, that's actually quite a nice ride. That's why I like riding first person when you do that. You can see it, it's like bumper cam for Descenders. Even though you're not a car, you know? That's what it feels like to me. Right, bus jump time. Is it going to go well is the real question. I've got no idea because uh, sometimes with this game, you, you just can't tell. I didn't do a fire node, I'm pretty sure. I only have three lives to do it in, so if I mess it up, um, one, that's an L. Two, I'm bad. And uh, three, then I have to go and do it again. 360 twice is on the cards. Uh, the landing is very, very flat, so this could go wrong. I don't know, though. I might be alright. I am alright. What is my bike? It feels so rigid as if the suspension's been cut off. I don't know why, but as of today, everything's built like rock hard as if I'm on the um, the little dirt jumper, but I'm not. It's like somebody took away my suspension and just welded steel poles instead. Right, I'll take that even though I'm, I'm done. I'm genuinely done. Yeah, my bike feels like literally just a solid frame of metal. No suspension at all. Imagine riding that. Oh, that's got to hurt. Because all of the... You are the suspension for yourself. That that must feel awful. Right, I should probably hop off of there. Goodbye. Bing. Bing. There we go. I'll take it. Right, let's see. Do we get to the next tier yet? Yeah. One, two, and three. No, but I do get the outfit, which I kind of do want to put on. Because it, it, it looks quite cool, okay? It genuinely looks quite cool. I don't want the silly little flag, but uh, if I go to the shed, um, under a boreal, let's put the helmet on. Let's put all of it on, apart from like the mohawk and the goggles. Um, a boreal. Yeah, this looks awful. What even is this? This is not good jersey design. I don't know who made that, but I'm sorry. Hock, hock doo doo, mate. That is not the best. Uh, I don't think it looks very nice. This though. It does look very nice. If I could zoom out, I'm not on a controller, so I don't have actual cam controls. I just have, oh, yeah, it's zoomed in now. Right, I'll put that one on, and then I'll pop the bombs on. Oh, it's a community pit. Oh, um, I'm sorry, dude, I feel bad. At least you got an item in the game. I didn't, so you've got a one-up on me. But I think this actually looks quite clean. I like the colours to it. It's like a dark green. I mean, it goes with the outfit that we're trying to ride with, so... I ain't got a problem with it. It looks nice. Why not? Let's let's keep it on. I think it looks clean. I like the colour scheme. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with it. Um, let me know if you like it too. Or might have to, you know, get rid of. But who knows? Probably not. Um, can I do a table? I wanted to try and table over that, but that didn't work. Okay, can I table at least here? Yes, but I'm dead. Okay. GG. Thank you all very much for watching and thank you very much to my money havers, Andrew, Grimm, Luna, Olam, Susie, Will and Warren. Thank you ever so much for supporting the channel. It really does mean a lot to me. If you'd like to become a money ever as well, please do press the join button below. Subscribe for more of this stuff and I'll see you a lot later. Goodbye.